Hi guys, DST here from NFT Tech. Welcome back on my channel. This video is not going to be about the beautiful exclusive Samsung wallpapers that you can check here. And by the way, also download because I extracted them all and put them online, right? This video is going to be about some fancy update that Samsung is pushing through. So we have new updates on Theme Park, Wonderland, Kiss Cafe and some other things. But I'll start with those three because these three are one of the models that people do use from good luck. Let's check the change lock, then we're gonna install them and try to test them. Theme Park right now is being updated to version 1.085, added customization UI for the chat bubble background in message up. Team list and team creation screen will be in dark mode when device is dark mode. Fixed a keycap shape error on Keys Cafe, fix minor bugs and improve internal logic. <laughs> I like that last one, improve internal logic. Sounds really cool. Next update is Wonderland. Wonderland getting right now the version 1.1.08. Very nice and simplistic change log. That's the change log I like. Add new style contents, spring and summer. Okay, this we can test for sure. And last but not least, guys, we have an exciting update on Keys Cafe. You now the tool used to customize your keyboard. The version right now is version 1.0.1.8. The keyboard touch sound option has been added to style your own keyboard. The flick function has been added to make your own keyboard. All right, there are also some new features. Change keyboard touch sound is pretty much what we've seen above and make flick K, add recommended keyboard, Dvorak, Zolemak, and mathematics. Okay, a lot of things to test. So guys, let me update all of this here. I'm gonna push update and I'm gonna be back with good luck, Key Cafe with Team Park and Wonderland and testing all of these things. All right, all right, guys. I updated everything we need for the video and I'm gonna be starting right now, good luck. Last time I was using another solution to good luck. So if you have problems installing good luck in your region, you might check this video here. There are options like nice luck and fine luck, but now back to the topic. So the first update I wanna test is the Wonderland. All right, they added two new things, remember, spring and summer. And let's just test them, guys. All right, where can we see them? Spring, okay. This is the spring one. I'm gonna set this as a wallpaper, set it to my home screen, and let's see how this will behave. Phone in my hand. <laughs> oh, okay. This one is nice. This one is <laughs> nice indeed, by the way. All right, you see? Bike is moving. People are walking to the... Oh, also in that mode? Okay, nice, nice, nice. People are moving. Ladies driving the bicycle. We have some nice birds here flying. Some leaves falling. Very nice. Okay. Let's check the summer one. I pretty much have the feeling what it's gonna be like. It has the same aesthetics and I think it's, it's quite pleasing, quite aesthetically nice. We have a gentleman here listening to his giant iPad in the sea, lady swimming here. Okay, quite nice. All right, so this has been the first update on Wonderland. So let's go now back to good luck. Let's go into the Keys Cafe and let's test some of the new things here. The Dvorak keyboard is already here and also Colmark keyboard. Okay, I'm gonna use the symbol keyboard. Okay, apply. Once I've selected the keyboard here, I'm gonna hit style your own keyboard. So we have the colors here, we have the effects and we have the sound. Let's start with the sound. So we have the retro sound, okay. Okay, quite nice. The calm touch sound. Okay, the fun touch sound, <laughs> the pink touch sound, okay, and the space touch sound. <laughs> That's nice. You know, I like the retro one. See, like a typewriter. Inside the make your own keyboard, we have also the matte keyboard. And when you click here, guys, you can apparently customize it further. I just want to show you something, guys. This is really going beyond any limitation. If we go back here and choose a simple keyboard, we can also add this new flick key, but if you press edit here, you can also go and here add custom emojis. The only limitation that you have is your own imagination, so you can go and customize your keyboard beyond anything else. Last but not least, we're gonna review the theme park where they added the customization option for the bubble background. So let's see if we wanna create a new one. Let's start from a new one, right next. And in this version, they added also the option to customize the background into the messenger gap. So let's see if you click here, for example, right, you can choose this color. So you see color changes. When we click here, you have to click the dust here, right? Let's go and change this color. You see color change. Now let's change this red color. You click here for that one. You can go here and you can make it blue. It's really, really nice the way you can customize things. Okay, one more thing. All right, let's go like this. See, 
absolutely customizable. With Theme Park, you can create your own team. If we go back and see all the options that you can choose, all the screens, all the settings, then you can choose to customize and then also customize the quick panel. It just works into the very same way. So let's say you want to customize the titles here. You go there and you can select different colors pretty much do whatever you want so it's really amazing and i believe it's a good thing that samsung is allowing these modifications to the end users without involving any complex apps and etc i really hope that you like this video if that's the case then a sub will be appreciated thank you guys for watching please stay safe and we're gonna catch up in one of the next videos vst over and bye